you're in a unique position that you coached at both Williams and in an Ivy League school. What's the difference between that level of player from the D3 high level, from the high level D3 to the Ivy? Like what really separates those two? Um, it's a good question. I think it's, they were probably a lot closer when I was at Williams at that time. You know, I think the Ivy League has really um, has become more like probably the Atlantic 10, you know, than the NESCAC as far as the caliber of players that are, that are choosing to go there. So, um, you know, when I was at Williams, we cross a little bit with, you know, maybe some Dartmouth or Columbia. It was Williams and Amherst and kids were kind of looking at the Ivy League and the NESCAC. You know, now I feel like kids are looking at the Ivy League or, you know, the WCC or the A10 or the MAC, um, you know, so I think like anything, it usually is, um, you know, size, uh, athleticism, um, maybe physically where guys are at, you know, I think certainly when someone's a junior or senior and a, and a, you know, a starter on a top 25 division three team, they can play most places, <laughs> you know, in the country, maybe not when they're 18, you know, uh, or maybe a chance to play earlier in their career, you know, um, but I think usually for, for division one, or at least for that, um, kids in that kind of academic mold, um, you know, size for their position, you know, you're six, six or six, 10, um, really have an, an, is something that you're elite at, you know, I think is really important. So what's going to be your, what's going to be your signature, you know, when, when, a, when a coach from Yale is evaluating you and they're evaluating four or five guys and they're making their pro con list and they're going through it. What are you, what are you better? Uh, what do you do at a high level? You know, what do you do at a division one level, whether that's division one athlete, division one shooting, division one playmaking, you know, there's gotta be something that when you're being recruited or when they're going to put you in a game or as an assistant, when I look down the bench and say, Hey, we've got to get Corey in there. What are we going to get? You know? Um, so I think that's what, <clears throat> and now that's really throughout the country, you know, because yeah. we're going in some ways, right? If you're Yale or Williams, you can recruit anywhere in the country, California. Even when I was there in 20, 2002, you know, we had a kid from Nashville, Ohio, California, and this is at Williams, you know, um, and so it's, it's, it's national, you know, they're both national programs. So, um, but I think that's usually the difference is kind of the one, the one difference maker that kind of separates you from, um, you know, from other guys in that, in that pack.